Almost as common as waiting on a passing train here in Angelo. Take your time. Don't want to rush. Is catching a glimpse of a Lake Nasworthy prairie dog minus the prairie and its many homes. This is not a natural place for prairie dogs to be. Meet Linda Watson, a true one-of-a-kind West Texan who's calling for protecting prairie dogs. Well, just kind of happened. I used to actually uh, be a cowboy, and I needed some extra money, and somebody asked me if I thought I could catch some prairie dogs, and I said, sure. Now, you may recognize Linda from Mike Rowe's hit TV show, Dirty Jobs. Today, Watson was in San Angelo doing what she does best. I have a ninth grade education, and here I have found this little tiny niche where I'm the only one in the world, I'm famous, and I'm able to do something that might last for hundreds and hundreds of years. So it's, it's a kid. So as Linda goes from one burrow to another, this process is all about keeping these little critters alive. You know, the point I need to make is, when I leave here today, I have done prairie dog removal, which is no different whatsoever than if they killed them. The big part of it is then to get them to safety. What I do is I allow Mother Nature to be cruel rather than mankind to be cruel. You know, let the chips fall and give them a chance. In addition to a little soap and water, well, there's more than just a technique when it comes to saving prairie dogs. You can't say it's too hot or you're afraid of getting bitten or... You pretty much have to love it. You pretty much have to love what you're doing in these animals. Before Linda's done for the day, she'll look to catch at least 60 or more prairie dogs doing San Angelo and its bite-sized friends a favor. Reporting from Lake Nasworthy, I'm Manny Diaz, KIDY, Fox News First.